Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am starting this vlog from the car just because I feel like I, I want to change it up a bit. I, do, I don't often start the vlogs from the car um, and I actually quite like it when other people do it so here I am. I'm about to go to a meeting for Bikini Bible. Um, I'm just giving it like a little update on what's going on and what exciting stuff we've got coming up what new styles we've got obviously we're going into winter but lots of people do go away for winter sun a few new colorways we're bringing back some of our old styles in a new pattern anyway loads of good things happening we've got exciting meetings about potentially getting in certain shops we've got the new range currently being made which we've already designed well lauren's designed it not me i won't i won't take um credibility for that and yeah just loads of exciting stuff i had the roguest thing happened to me last night. I went to take the bins out. Jordan was at work. I went to take the bins out. I had no shoes on, tracksuit bottoms, and my hair and my hands stank of garlic because I was cooking upstairs. Thank God I didn't turn the oven on. The door closed behind me, and I was locked outside with no phone, no shoes, nothing. Can you can you actually imagine? And I was literally trying to break into my own home. I looked like a fucking psychopath. I then had to go next door and thankfully someone was in and I had to use their phones to email Jordan because I don't know his number off by heart to be like, come and save me, SOS, help. A day in the life, seriously, honestly. If you could, like that is just so classic me. As if the door closed behind me and as if I did. Imagine if I had a kid, a baby, and the baby was locked in upstairs. Imagine if I left the oven on. It could have been so much worse dramas the dramas right after my meeting i'm then actually going to drive to surrey because i need to drop some things off to my mum um and this is the only day i have spare to do anything so and then this evening i'm going to a really exciting itsu event but yeah busy day we just got some gifting hashtag oh my god hashtag i've arrived hashtag fair facts and faith <laughs> why do you keep saying i've arrived did you message me that the other day going i have arrived i've arrived because the big boys are gifting my favorite come on holland cooper you've made it mum i have what even are these i'm just hugging a box I don't open them quick them. so this is their breast cancer um awareness stuff so oh it's kind God, of i'm shaking oh oh my love oh. wow they're, they're very you lovely for winter perfect hot racing then yeah this is my favorite oh. i think that's oh, really smart sweetie darling darling sweetie if ever mick come in for me i shall wear this <laughs> <laughs> if ever mean Chelsea, yes. if you ever see Rachel mean Chelsea, that is what she's going to be yes. wearing the whole I, outfit. I will, and I will posh right up yeah. for the part. That's, that's, wow. That's really nice. I feel a bit regal. You are regal, Rach. We're going to be calling you double R. Yeah. Oh my God, I've just spotted something terrible in the, uh, what the hell are they? Oh my gardening shoes. Don't, because I'm washing all the paintwork. Oh my paint God. Jordan has just left me and gone to Italy with the boys um, for the weekend because he's going to watch the Ryder Cup. So I've got the girls coming round um, and I thought I would use my HelloFresh box, which got delivered the other day to make them something yummy. This video is kindly sponsored by HelloFresh. They have got brand new 15 minute meals, which is so quick and easy. Um, I am all about quick, fast making dinners, not gonna lie most of the time i do not have time to sit and make dinners that take a long time so anything quick and easy i'm all here for it click this qr code it will take you there my code is emilyb60 and that gives you 60 percent off your first box and 25 percent off the next eight boxes tonight i'm thinking about keeping it very light and doing the roast potato bacon and crispy kale salad because i found something light nothing heavy this evening quick easy a new place, a new home For a while, let me feel alive Nothing to hold me back Take my time, just enjoy the ride A new man passing by 
Life is good, best I've ever felt Get me up, so ending Somewhere I can find myself On a side note, I don't know who I think I am today but I also made myself, okay, it looks a bit burnt, but it's actually not, a banana bread. Because my bananas were going off and Jordan isn't here to eat them. So I decided to make myself a banana loaf. In fact, take me back to the, uh, the quarantine days, the lockdown days. I haven't made one for a while, but I hate to see bananas go to waste. And it's kind of the best way to make use of them. I've had a, had a day of, of cooking, to be honest. Okay. Do excuse my hair right now. I'm not, I'm just, I'm currently just rushing um, to get to this event that I'm going to this evening. An Itsu event. I mean, quite random. So I'm just chucking on a bit of makeup. I've already got some makeup on, but I'm being that lazy girl. Um, I'm just quickly touching up slightly because, oh, well. To say I'm rushing um, is an understatement, but classic me, my life is just constantly one big rush or one big drama. We've just got so much going on with different things and I can't wait to show you all and it's just, it's just going to be a great 2024. I can feel it guys. We're going to have such a good year next year. So many things are bubbling, so many things in the pipeline. Oh god, I'm also just quite sweaty right now, um, and I'm being so gross, I'm not even showering. I did have a shower this morning though, so. It's the best concealer in the world, the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. I absolutely love this. It's a big Space NK order as well for some new things. Um, so when that arrives, I will show you guys what I've got. I'm kind of trying new makeup at the moment because I'm a bit bored of my current makeup routine. Um, I actually got this new Charlotte Tilbury, which I love. And this is amazing as well. This Glowgasm face palette, which is just, I'm just obsessed with makeup. I don't know about you, but I just love, firstly, watching people do their makeup. Secondly, buying all the things like if i ever need new makeup or like need inspo for what makeup i should buy i just go on reels or youtube videos of people that i love and i just watch what they buy like watch what they use and i just and i just buy it it's like the best way to do it because you can kind of like see them actually use the product and for example i like the way sarah ashcroft does her makeup so i often go onto her instagram and look at like have I gone too much on the blush here? I mean, I will blend it in a bit. Um, I often go onto her Instagram and just, if I only want new makeup or makeup top-ups or whatever. Oh my God, excuse the washing. There's always washing in this bedroom. I also use this palette, this one here, the brown. I kind of use that at the moment as a little uh, eyeshadow. It's not meant to, it's meant to be bronze, but it works really well as an eyeshadow. So, I'm feeling browns because it's autumn. I'm so excited for autumn. I said the word autumn in my last vlog, I want to say a thousand times. So when I was editing it, I was like, I really need to just shut up. So I'm actually not going to bang on about that right now because <laughs> I've just, it, I annoy myself. One thing you know, being like a YouTuber or editing videos, you really get to know how weird you are as an individual like i am so bizarre some of the stuff i have to clip out because i'm like i'm just too weird i'm too weird uh i also completely binge watched top boy and i'm now using this highlighter by the way it was amazing i genuinely couldn't stop speaking guys comment below if you have the same if you watch top boy and you just couldn't start speaking like stop speaking like i was from the hood like i just i i, I just sent literally i want to say please tell me you did the same but i sent so many voice notes to so many of my friends just speaking like i was in top boy i also got this charlotte tilbury it's called sunlight sunlit glow and i'm just i don't even know what i'm doing i'm just chucking it on my eyes because i just think let's just do something a little bit different here uh so yeah that happened i'm saying say less every time 
Jordan called, called me and I put down the phone. I was like, all right, say less. And I just hung out and he's literally so fed up with me speaking like I'm from Top Boy. I need to just, I need to stop. I need to stop because I will be single in 0.2 seconds if I continue. Also, this is new as well. I'm showing you all my new things. I'm really, that is bothering me because I like being clean and tidy, but we, like I say, we're keeping it real here. I am using now the Rare Beauty Matte Lip Liner. I used it for the first time today. Let me know your thoughts. I actually can't talk while I'm doing this. This was not meant to be like a makeup get ready with me. I just kind of thought I may as well chat to you while I quickly get ready for this event. Oh, I actually like it. I'm gonna do this smudgy thing that people are doing these days. They're just like sort of smudging it in and then filling it in uh, with a lip gloss, which I actually think I love this. What color is this? Guys, you need to go get this. This is lovely. It doesn't say a color, so that's good, but it's like that. It's from Rare Beauty. Um, and then I'm gonna put a bit of gloss on, which is the world's cheapest lip gloss, but it's amazing. What do you think of this combo? I'm actually feeling it, guys. Woof. I've got this new rose ink, rose ink mascara, which, to be honest, it's very thick. Like, God knows how I'm going to get this off my eyelashes because it's stuck, stuck, stuck on. But I like trying out new ones. I'm not sure yet if I'll ever find one as much as I love my roller lash or even the Eve Saint one that I used for ages. Um, but, you know, I'm happy to try new ones. I'm happy to give them a crack. And, uh, yeah, God knows what I'm going to wear to this event. Um, I'm just going to quickly puff, oh, puff my eyebrows up a bit as well, just to make me look a bit more alive. Okay, right, I'm done. This is calling it a day. I'm just going to quickly brush my hair, chuck on some clothes, and get the hell out of here. The traffic is so bad around Putney, which is where I'm currently going. So I think I might get the tube or walk the whole way, which will then make me even more incredibly late. But we live, we learn. I curled my hair again. You know, back like ages ago, I used to use tongs on my hair. I hadn't done it in ages, but I'm actually quite enjoying the tonged look because it does make my hair look quite thick. Um, so I feel like maybe I get back into doing it like this. Cause I'm quite enjoying it. What do we think? I'm keeping it super light, natural makeup. I'm done. I just need to quickly pick an outfit now. I am finally back home. I'm so full. I ate so much chicken ramen gozers. I'm actually full to the brim. I can't breathe. I am going to sort out this room before bed. It is now nine o'clock. 10 past nine. This room needs a bit of a, this is just what happens when I get ready for things. Clothes go everywhere. I probably clean this room, I wanna say three times a day. I mean, so I'm gonna quickly sort that out now. Take my makeup off, do a lovely skin, clean, um, have a quick shower before bed and get an early night. Cause I'm gonna get up early, go to the gym. And then after that, I have filming at 11 a.m. for Maiden Chelsea, so need to get ready for a busy day tomorrow. just cleansed my face, cleansed my face with Dr. Sturm, Sturm, and I'm just quickly whacking on some of this drunk elephant oil 
just because my skin is feeling dry. Quick put on of this Dr. Jart moisturizer. And time for bed for me. So I'm gonna love you and leave you. Is there anything more appealing than your bed when you are exhausted? I cannot wait to jump in there. Hello gang, so last time I vlogged was actually a while ago, but I kind of just wanted to round up and finish this vlog. Thought as we have just launched a few new Bible colors and styles, I thought I'd just quickly show you a couple of them because if any of you have got any winter sun coming up, or you're going away, or you just want to treat yourself to a bikini, I'm going to leave a little code especially for my YouTube followers on the screen and in the description box below just because I love you guys and yeah, if you're watching it and you want a discount. My personal favourite, I mean you guys asked us for, to bring back the Luna Bandeau one because Bandeau? Bandeau? I don't even know. But it's strapless and it's just really good for tanning and to be honest I did miss it this season so we've brought it back for mini collection and range but we've brought it back in different colours. So we've got it in this sapphire, which is also got like a shine to it as well. If you can see in the light, it's kind of like shiny. And then the middle is this gold ring with like the detail here. And then this side, I mean, it's not reversible, but it's like a different kind of blue. It's more of like a turquoisey blue. This I wear in a size small. It is very good for your kind of bigger bust girlies. We've changed the sizing slightly on them as well. And um, they've kind of gone a bit more true to size rather than on the smaller side. And then the bikini bottoms that go with it are these, which we have changed slightly. We've given more coverage on the bum because we, we felt like it was the right time to do a bikini with a tiny bit more coverage and it still makes you look and feel very sexy. And yeah, we've got the matching ring here. So they do come up a bit higher, so like that. Um, but yeah, these are like my favorite bottoms that we've ever done. They're incredible. So got the swimming costume, which s sells out so quickly. It's so flattering and it's just, it's such a good purchase. We decided to do it in a few more colors um, and we chose this material here, which is like a glittery brown kind of material, which is just so nice. And again, we've used the same gold rings. And this is a size, and then that's the back. I mean, showing you like this really does it no justice, to be honest with you. I should really be doing this on, but. This is a size small. So as you can see, the bust is quite small on this, but it does stretch. Um, size smalls fit me, so yeah. One of my personal favorites is this sarong. I love this. Honestly, they're so lovely. Um, they sold really well, and they and we've got a mat, and we've got obviously the pattern that matches all the different bikinis. If you go online to Bikini Bible, you'll see it. We do this. Sorry, I haven't got all them all here to show you, but we do this style now, also in this pattern, which again is selling fast. And then we decided also just to bring the swimming, the Gigi swim, in black because black's just one of those key colours, and it's so flattering. So we were just like, let's do it in black, and everyone's loving it. So yeah, there's a little sneak peek, and I hope you enjoy. I hope you enjoy this video, guys. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will.